So what I'm going to talk about today is a little bit difficult, and I understand it's hard to talk about, but someone needs to. And so this is basically, this is my story. When I was 10, I it was the first time I was ever sexually assaulted. It was by my babysitter. I was 18 years old. My parents trusted him. He, they left him with us, and it was a really horrible experience. I didn't know that that would be the first of many times that this would happen to me later on in life. This is not a story that is unique to me. This is a story that is like this many women's stories all the way from children to adults and it happens all the time. And one thing I didn't realize until later when I was actually talking to guys is that porn often leads to abuse. It, porn romanticizes abusive behaviors, that it normalizes them. They think these things, we even like them. They think it's normal and they think it's okay. They think that shoving people against the wall, choking them, smacking them, tying them up is romantic or cute or something they'll enjoy. When really it's traumatizing, it's terrifying. In fact, many women watch porn just to try to prepare themselves for what they think is going to come later on. Because we know they're watching it. We know that they're gonna have expectations. We know that they're going to do these things and we need to, we try to prepare ourselves the best we can, but nothing really can prepare you for that. And it's a really terrifying experience. I have a younger brother, he's 15 now. My parents never really talked to him about it. I grew up knowing that guys were watching these things, knowing what they were watching, and experiencing the abuse that resulted from what they were watching. And I did not want my brother to follow that path. I wanted him to treat women with dignity and respect. And in order for him to do that, I really did not want him to watch any kind of porn. Because I knew that that would screw up his idea of what women enjoy, how to treat them well. And I talked to him from a young age because I mean, I knew my guy friends were watching it by the time they were like 11, 12 on. So by the, when he was little, I talked to him, I said, hey, listen, do not watch this. It's something that you can never get back. It's something that will ruin you for the rest of life. It's something that will ruin, it's something that will ruin women for the rest of their lives. It's not just something that affects your son or your daughter. It's something that affects everyone that they encounter. And I told him this and my parents didn't talk to my brother because they didn't think they needed to, but they did. His friends show him porn at lunch. It's something he encounters all the time. And he has actually talked to me and said, I am glad that you warned me because now I won't watch it. And my friends try to show it to me and they call me lame for not watching it. So this is a problem that affects everyone and something that needs to be talked about because it's not just something that will affect your children. It's something that is going to affect everyone that your children will encounter for the rest of their lives. So please talk to your kids for their sakes and for the sakes of many women and men around the world.